फर्स्ट सेमेस्टर और यू जी एन ई पी कोर्सेस एस ए सी डिजिटल फ्लुएंसी आंसर्स विद एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑफ क्वेश्चन पेपर ऑफ फेब्रवरी टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी फोर फर्स्ट क्वेश्चन B artificial intelligence C advanced intelligence D advanced internet right answer is B artificial intelligence AI stands for artificial intelligence it's a growing field and all professionals are in demand discover more about AI and what the future looks like question 2 examples of AI digital assistants is A options A Amazon Alexa B Apple Siri C Google Assistant D all of the above right answer is D all of the above examples of AI digital assistants are voice assistants right sonic blackberry assistant chatbots hound microsoft artificial intelligence ai duo brainer fireflies file socratic voice assistants amazon alexa google assistant siri cortana bixby question 3 Examples of smart devices are options A smartphones B self driving cars C smart watch D all of the above right answer is D all of the above examples of smart technology smart refrigerators smart thermostats smart bulbs smart security cameras smart speakers smart plugs smart displays smart locks smart security alexa doorbell cameras smart lighting philips hue robot vacuum apple glasses connected cars iot devices pet cameras smart home products smart hub smart tvs question 4 the characteristics of the computer system capable of thinking reasoning and learning is known as options a machine intelligence b human intelligence C artificial intelligence D virtual intelligence right answer is C artificial intelligence the characteristics of the computer system capable of thinking reasoning and learning is known as artificial intelligence question 5 dl stands for options a deep linking b deep learning c drone launching d depth learning right answer is b deep learning Deep learning is a subset of machine learning methods. Actually, deep learning methods are based on neural network methods, which is also a machine learning method and those methods are around since the 1960s. Question 6. Which of the following are the application areas of AI? Options: A. Neural networks. B. Pattern recognition. C. Natural language processing. D. All of the above. The correct answer is option D. all of the above mentioned options are the informed search methods that are used in artificial intelligence question 7 which of the following are machine learning methods options a supervised learning b semi supervised learning c reinforcement learning d all of the above machine learning involves showing a large volume of data to a machine to learn make predictions find patterns or classify data The four machine learning types are supervised, unsupervised, semi-supervised learning and reinforcement learning. Hence the right answer is D all of the above. Question 8. Machine learning is a subset of options: A deep learning, B digital marketing, C artificial intelligence, D none of the above. Right answer is C artificial intelligence. Machine learning is a subset of artificial intelligence. It's one of the AI algorithms we've developed to mimic human intelligence. The other type of AI would be symbolic AI or good old fashioned AI. Question 9. The order of data analytics process is options: A analysis info inside data, B inside data analysis info, C data info inside analysis, D info inside analysis data. Right answer is C data info insight analysis the data analysis process involves data decision collection cleaning analysis interpretation and visualization every stage comes together to transform raw data into meaningful insights question 10 the cloud refers to options 
A. Network or Internet. B. Personal Computer. C. Artificial Intelligence. D. None of the above. Right answer is A. Network or Internet. The definition for the cloud can seem murky, but essentially, it's a term used to describe a global network of service, each with a unique function. The cloud is not a physical entity, but instead is a vast network of remote service around the globe. Question 11. Technology that uses remote service on the internet to store, manage and access data online rather than local drives is. Options. A. Store computing. B. Cloud computing. C. Manage computing. D. Quantum computing. Right answer is B. Cloud computing. Data storage is the most important use of cloud computing. Question 12. Which of the following applications is used to predict the traffic? Options. A. Google Pay. B. Google Calendar. C. Google Map. D. Google Slide. Right answer is C. Google Map. Google Maps is used by numerous people on a daily basis while traveling as the navigation platform effectively predicts traffic and plots routes for them. Question 13. A neural network composed of the following layers. Options. A. Input layer. B. Hidden layer. C. Output layer. D. All of the above. Every neural network consists of layers of nodes or artificial neurons and input layer, one or more hidden layers and an output layer. Each node connects to others and has its own associated weight and threshold. Therefore right option is D all of the above. Question 14. The ability of a machine to learn by itself using large data sets is known as Options. A. Machine learning. B. Artificial intelligence. C. Deep learning. D. None of the above. Right answer is A. Machine learning. Question 15. Which of the following is an open source relational database management system? Options. A. Oracle. B. MySQL. C. MS Access. D. None of the above. A database management system is software that is used to create, manage and maintain a database. MySQL is a popular open source relational database management system choice for web-based applications. Developers. Database administrators and DevOps teams use MySQL to build and manage next-generation web and cloud-based applications. Therefore right answer is B. MySQL. Question 16. A software system that is designated to manage and organize data in a structured manner is known as Options. A. Database management system. B. Artificial intelligence. C. Deep learning. D. Machine learning. Right answer is a database management system. ADBMS serves as an interface between the database and its end users or programs, allowing users to retrieve, update, and manage how the information is organized and optimized. Question 17. Which of the following are the benefits of IoT? Options. A. Improvement of operational performance. B. Ensuring safety. C. Increasing flexibility. D. All of the above. We've narrowed down the top benefits of IoT in manufacturing to these three areas. 1. Improvement of operational performance. 2. Ensuring safety and compliance. 3. Increasing flexibility and agility. Therefore right option is D. All of the above. Question 18. IoT devices are naturally vulnerable to the following threats. Options. A. Sensors. B. Heterogeneity. C. Security. D. Connectivity. Right answer is C. Security. IoT devices are naturally vulnerable to security threats. There is a high level of transparency and privacy issues with IoT. Question 19. IIoT stands for Options. A. Internet Internet of Things. B. Industrial Internet of Things. C. Intelligence Internet of Things. D. Internal Internet of Things. Right answer is B. Industrial Internet of Things. IIoT stands for the Industrial Internet of Things and as the name suggests it refers to the use of Internet of Things technology, connected machines, devices and sensors in industrial applications. Question 20. Cyber security aims to Options. A. Reduce the risk of cyber attacks. B. Protect against the unauthorized exploitation of systems. C. Both A and B. D. None of the above. 
Right option is C. Both A and B. It aims to reduce the risk of cyber attacks and protect against the unauthorized exploitation of systems, networks, and technologies. Question 21. What is cyber security? Options. A. Cyber security provides security against malware. B. Cyber security provides security against cyber terrorism. C. Cyber security protects a system from cyber attacks. D. All of the above. Cyber security is the protection of systems, programs, networks, devices and data from cyber attacks with the help of technology and processes. Its primary aim is to reduce cyber attacks and protect systems, networks and technologies from unauthorized exploitation. Therefore right option is D. All of the above. Question 22. Common types of cyber attacks are Options A. Malware B. Phishing C. Password attack D. All of the above 10 most common types of cyber attacks are Malware Denial of service attacks Phishing Spoofing identity-based attacks Code injection attacks Supply chain attacks Insider threats DNS tunneling IoT-based attacks Therefore right option is D. All of the above Question 23 which of the following is used to avoid cyber attacks? Options. A. Regularly change password. B. Install and use antivirus. C. Both A and B. D. None of the above. Right answer is C. Both A and B. Question 24. The process of analyzing large amount of data is known as. Options. A. Big data analytics. B. Large data analytics. C. Huge data analytics. D. None of the above. Right answer is A. Big Data Analytics. The process of uncovering trends, patterns, and correlations in large amounts of raw data to help make data-informed decisions. These processes use familiar statistical analysis techniques like clustering and regression and apply them to more extensive datasets with the help of newer tools. Question 25. Software mainly used to help users to detect viruses and avoid them is known as Options A. Antivirus B. Malware C. Public Key D. Firmware Right answer is A. Antivirus Antivirus is a kind of software used to prevent, scan, detect and delete viruses from a computer. Once installed, most antivirus software runs automatically in the background to provide real-time protection against virus attacks. Question 26. Choose the most important use of cloud computing. Options. A. Privacy. B. Data storage. C. Cost effectiveness. D. Security. Right answer is B. Data storage. Data storage is the most important use of cloud computing. Question 27. Which of the following is a part of digital communication? Options. A. Email. B. WhatsApp messages. C. Both A and B. D. None of the above. Digital communication is the communication that is transferred through signals from digital devices. It can send any type of information digitally. Example, email, texting, video conferencing, social media, television, digital radio, etc. Therefore, right option is C. Both A and B. Question 28. The following are the essential components of communication. Options. A. Source. B. Message. C. Receiver. D. All of the above. Eight essential components of communication are. Source. Message. Channel. Receiver. Feedback. Environment. Context. Interference. Therefore right option is D. All of the above. Question 29. Which of the following are the types of communication? Options. A. Verbal communication. B. Non-verbal communication. C. Both A and B. D. None of the above. Five types of communication. 1. Verbal communication. Verbal communication occurs when we engage in speaking with others. 2. Non-verbal communication. What we do while we speak often says more than the actual words. 3. Written communication. 4. Listening. 5. Visual communication. Therefore right option is C. Both A and B. Last question 30. Which of the following are the benefits of effective communication? Options. A. Building trust. B. Preventing or resolving problems. 
C. Promote team building. D. All of the above. Benefits of effective communication are improved productivity, increased employee engagement, better relationships, trust, better collaboration, innovation, increased job satisfaction, team building, boosts creativity, conflict resolution, better engagement, career advancement, clear expectations, communication, decision making, improved morale, listening, handle conflict, clarity, customer satisfaction, clearer direction for employees, enhances organizational culture, healthy workplace culture, improved client relations. Therefore right option is D, all of the above. Thank you. See you again next video.